Conclusion of the day. Passion <laughs> propeller. <laughs> Erotic constructions. Your man lies on top of you, entering you in traditional missionary style, but then, yowza. <laughs> he starts doing a 360-degree spin, <laughs> all the while keeping his penis deep inside of you. As he's rotating and thrusting, help guide him around your body like a propeller would spin around the top of a helicopter. <laughs> I'm trying, that's a subtitle. <laughs> I'm trying to incorporate more parkour into my sex life. <laughs> Through a series of tests that I recently conducted in my small in home laboratory, I learned that simply deciding that you want to photosynthesize doesn't automatically give you the ability to do it. <laughs> These controversial test results subsequently cause a huge rift within the scientific community as well as my personal life, my dad. <laughs> I'm learning to interact more productively with the world. I'm learning to reap emotional reinforcement from reading the packaging of products. Life hack, boxes of cereal are often trying to tell you that you are good and that you deserve good things. <laughs> you can read boxes of cereal to feel assured of this. <laughs> boxes of cereal are also often trying to sell you cereal. This is not important, nor is it part of the life hack. <laughs> movements and dropping references to myself as an appreciator of the arts more often in conversation with peers and superiors. <laughs> my LinkedIn profile is simply a click-through link to my OkCupid profile. <laughs> it's working really well for me. Thank you. <laughs> Trying to discern whether or not your head is a stupid side is not productive nor is it a life hack. <laughs> Drinking tea is a life hack but only if you like tea. Liking the idea of tea doesn't count. <laughs> Learn that the hard way. Telling yourself that you could be a great president of this country if you put your mind to it could positively affect your self-esteem. What most people don't know is that the president's job isn't even that hard. He's often just trying to sell you cereal. <laughs> Life hack, the existence of the entire U.S. government is an advertising ploy from Kellogg's. <laughs> I know this because I have conducted the research in my small in-home research center. I'm okay with the idea of robots rising up to destroy the way of life as we know it, but only because I'm too lazy to organize an uprising of my own. <laughs> life hack. Speed up the settings of your life so you're experiencing it at two seconds per second. You'll be done twice as fast. <laughs> life hack. Pour Kool-Aid in your wounds. Why not? <laughs> life hack. Doors can be used to enter one room from a different room. Life hack. <laughs> areas means less chance that a person living there will be financially capable of suing you if said person seriously harm their health and the health of their loved ones. <laughs> you guys can use that one. Minnesota mom improves her quality of life with this one weird tip. <laughs> Acknowledging the fleeting nature of existence and resolving to be nice to others. <laughs> it's important to decide to do things only after already confirming that you have the ability to do them. However, I still haven't given up on photosynthesizing. <laughs>